In today's video, I'm going to show you the best graphic settings for Modern Warfare 2 2022. The first thing I like to do is go down to custom frame rate and go to show more and max the custom frame rate limit out because I believe it's set to 250. Or the next thing you want to do is go to quality and just copy these settings. You want to put your render resolution to 100, NVIDIA DLSS off, NVIDIA image scaling off, AMD FSR off. Turn on the Fidelity FX. And then this option's up to you, but I prefer to have it on the higher side, so I have mine set to 100. And then anti-aliasing, SMAA. Nearby level of detail low, texture resolution normal, texture filter low, particle quality high, bullet impacts and sprays on, shader quality low, tessellation off, on demand texture streaming, you always want this off, streaming quality I've set to low, shadow map resolution low, spot shadow quality low, with the cache, for both of them, you want them turned on. Particle lighting low. Ambient occlusion off. SSR off. NVIDIA reflex low latency on. I have it on and boost because of what CPU and GPU combo I have. Depth of field off. World motion blur off and weapon motion blur off. And film grain to zero. And with these settings, I get over 170 FPS on all maps and I run a 10700K with a 3070 Ti and I will show you gameplay later on as well. Another thing you can do if you're having trouble seeing people is turn up your vibrance and now let me show you how to do that. Now what I use for this is a program called Vibrance GPU I believe no, Vibrance GUI. Now all it is is a little program right here and it'll up your Vibrance for the game only instead of your whole monitor. For example, if you open up NVIDIA Control Panel and then right here, the monitor you're on, you can up the digital vibrance but that'll do everything on your monitor always this right here only allows this slider to go up on the application you set it to so all you have to do is type in vibrancegui.com and download this little thing right here then once it's downloaded while you have the game running all you have to do is click add it'll be right here called cod it could be somewhere else in this list though for you. Double click on it. Set it to whatever vibrance you want. I play on 75. Hit save. Then it'll show up right here saying you have it added to which programs you want it to run on. And it'll always run in the in the task bar in the tray and now let me show you the difference in game as you can see this is what the game looks like this is the only map that I get low lower frames on oddly enough right now you can see I'm running I get 150 plus on this map now this is what the game looks like with filters on and this is what the game looks like with filters off as you can see it's more gray washed out just, uh, you know, not very vibrant, just like Tr which Treyarch games tend to be more vibrant. I just got my head blown off.
a spawn. Talk about a garbage spawn. What the heck? Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.